I went to college and I did fine art painting and I couldn't really make much money out of that so I became a milliner. Uh, my great aunt was a milliner to the Queen and so she sort of used to always encourage me to, it was like a nice creative thing to do. I used to go and visit her when I was a kid and she used to have an amazing studio. And so I just thought, oh, I really like hats, so I think I'll start making hats. So I started making hats and I went to college to learn and the woman who taught me was at the time making the Queen's hats, which was quite amazing. And it took me three years to make three hats. It was so hard. I used to go to the toilets and cry because she'd always go, no, 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 the line is wrong. And I'm like, oh, no, it was really hard. But I really appreciate her now because she made me learn how to do something properly. I love the creation process. It always makes me feel really satisfied at the end of the day. If I've made something or if I've created something, especially if it's something new. If I'm doing 400 or something, that's really hard. I just love creating and making things. I can't stand it just being it behind a computer all day. I'm not made for that. I have to make and create. I like the little cocktail hats, the felt ones. They're really good to make and they're sort of really structural and they like little sculptures. And they're great fun because you steam them and we hand sew them all and then you decorate them with feathers and things. They're good fun and then you see them put on somebody's head and they just totally transform the person. And the person looks amazing in it. I just love that. And it looks like it was made specially for them. I work together closely with my husband, Niall. He's really part of the creative process as well and he does a lot of the making and steaming and cutting. He cuts all the hats by hand. I keep him incredibly busy. There's a couple of us in the workshop sewing and we're quite fast sewers, so we're always wanting to be fed with new things. So Niall's definitely a very big part of this business and we've built it together. We've just opened a coffee shop and we did painted murals and we've been doing art classes out there. I've been doing encaustic painting and millinery classes out there, which is really good fun. And it made the shop something other rather than being just a shop. It was a space where people could come and meet. And we love giving away free coffee, so <laughs> it's really lovely. I like it. Changed our business.